Let's get to yep. it. Done. Let's quench our thirst for Star Trek. <laughs> <laughs> everyone it's the Gallifrey gals we're back here on youtube watching and reacting to star trek the next generation because this is the Gallifrey gals get warped i did it too soon <laughs> you did it and i kept talking and i was like hold it hold it hold it now now uh and what were we just talking about the next show that we're going to be watching what gonna are we going to call it and you know how i think it'd be cool to let our patrons decide yeah. what the next like Gallifrey gals get titled of our, you know, Battlestar Galactica reactions are. Um, so more incentives to sign up for our Patreon if you feel like supporting right, us. Right. And and because like I genuinely leave if you can't, we've talked about the dollar tier. I should remind mm. people about the dollar tier. The dollar <gasps> oh, tier. Oh yeah. Mark. It just is that little like you're thinking like, about I wanna us. Support, and you I want to support. I want to be able to to the best of your vote on these polls or some of these other yes. little things. I leave you the polls at the dollar level. Yeah. I leave the polls accessible to everybody. Uh, dollar tier and all so that you can all be a part of that um so yeah Keep and if 100 things. people support at the dollar level that's an extra hundred dollars for the month you know what Which i mean crazy. like that adds up so it adds up big be time shy. yeah um you can also be like well i want to give more than a dollar but i don't want to be at one of the you can be you can choose an option actually yeah so patreon lets you choose so you support at that tier but the you can min, like, change the amount you're actually giving mm -hmm. so you can be like i support at the dollar tier but i'm actually gonna give three dollars yeah you can do that or you can support cool. at one of our higher tiers where you're getting full-length reactions and choose to support for more than what that costs if you wanted to that option is available should you feel so led in your heart to <laughs> to do so do that and, and if so then wow that's you're how i amazing can feed myself i want to say thank you for uh, paying rent. <laughs> uh yeah, yeah we just really true. appreciate it anyways very excited yeah. for all the shows we've got coming up yeah. there's gonna be like i think it's gonna get a little like we've got a few things on the docket that we want to like yeah. do so there's gonna be some like shifting maybe a day well, is gonna get added our to... flagship shows if you will are yeah. kind of like they're they're changing and how they are we're wrapping them up like yeah doctor who is different right now star trek's almost done like things are gonna it's start crazy. looking maybe a little more like how our animated tier looks because we are always swapping into a new show with animation right so always and so now it's just yeah. kind of coming to that point yeah. i mean doctor who like we've previously previously stated in other videos like we're gonna milk that shit for as long as we can oh yeah we'll we've keep watching classic, classic who. who and then we'll have new episodes <laughs> that come out yeah but. done um but yes yeah, but that main like the new who was that thing that we were like that was it, you know? Yeah. Um, and now that's done for at the moment. It's so interesting. Mm -hmm. So yeah, lots of stuff coming, gonna be some shifting around, maybe an extra day of reactions, depending on like what shows are about to all be added, you know? Yeah. You know? Throw it out. So anyways, okay. we're gonna watch episode 22. Two. Two. 22. <laughs> episode 22 of Star Trek The Next Generation, a season seven, it's called The Battle. No? Fuck me. <sighs> that was the... <laughs> It's called Bloodlines. Sorry, it references a season one. Ep this episode, I'll just go into it. This episode brings back a character from a season one episode oh, called wow. The Battle. So I had pulled that up to look at it and remind myself what the heck was going on to help I don't me even remind remember you. That. Why yeah. would you? It's from yeah, season why would one. I? Why would I remember why that? Why would you remember that? Uh, we'll talk about it when it comes up in the intro. But if that one's called The Battle and that one was pulled up, so I just glanced at it and read that and went, that's completely that's so wrong. So wrong. This so is one bloodlines. more time. Bloodlines. Okay, yeah. interesting. Um, so. All right, Bloodlines. We've got some more family shit. Damn. It's all about the Three family. episodes in a row. I mean, that's, my, that's my assumption. Um, all right. I don't know. We got nothing else. Look, I trust you remember me. <laughs> because I haven't forgotten you. None of us remember you, Bach. murdered my son. I'm going to kill your son, Picard. Just like you killed mine. Picard's got a son now? 
Data found out that the woman you mentioned has a son named Jason. This is the most recent picture we could find. <laughs> He's bald and looks just... <laughs> <laughs> Scan for human life signs. So crazy that they can do that. I'm yeah, right? I'm humans. I'm having difficulty getting a clear reading on the eighth. <laughs> The individual appears to be approximately two kilometers beneath the planet's surface. Oh. I'm reading seismic instability in the area. He is in danger. Oh, good. Relay his coordinates to the transport <laughs> and have them beam him aboard. Excuse me. Aye, sir. Beam this random person aboard. <laughs> He's gonna be like, what the fuck? <laughs> what am I doing here? What's going on? Oh, yeah, jeez. I realize I wasn't supposed to be splunking that cave. <laughs> but don't you have something better? <laughs> we thought you were at risk. Oh. Well, I wasn't. So maybe you should just beam me back where I was. <laughs> are you Jason Vito? <laughs> I'm here because you're in danger. Why would anybody want to kill me? Well... The person who has made the threat is under the impression that you are my son. Yeah, I my mother never told me who my father was. Just that he was in Starfleet. Uh-oh. Maybe we should contact her. That's she died a few years ago. Of course. Oh, time to do a DNA test, baby. What do you do? Uh, I'm between jobs right now. I steal things. <laughs> Excuse me, gentlemen. The test results are ready if you'd like Jeez, to it's so fast. This took all of two seconds to run. And your father, Jean-Luc Picard. Holy shit. Ooh, how does Beverly feel about Holy this? Holy shit. This is a gall and prayer stick. It's, it's really quite rare. Probably worth a lot of is money. Valuable? Is it valuable? Really. I did have to hand over a bottle of very old sorry and brandy for it. <laughs> I really want to be honest oh, with you, he's Jason. Pissed. He's upset. I only knew your mother for a very short time, but told me about you. If she had, I would have been part of your life. Maybe that's not what she wanted. Okay. Well, <laughs> all right. <sips> tea. <laughs> well, what is the situation with Buck anyway? I mean, why does he want me dead? Years ago, well... I was forced to destroy a starship commanded by his son. Bok apparently feels that it would be fitting vengeance to kill my son. Your being here, I hope it will give us the chance to get to know each other. And he's like, yeah, well. Thank you for taking the time to talk with us, Damon. I understand you have a problem. He was relieved of command six years ago. He was unstable. <sighs> We had to confine him to Rock Prison. Uh, he was able to buy himself out about two years ago. I see. You don't have to thank me, Captain. Oh, God. This is so fucking oh, pompous. Ferengi. Might have so been fucking pompous. There's a nebula in the Dorius cluster that matches the same particle signature we found on the probe. Aha! Aha! Got him! Three light years from the nebula. Beverly. Jean Luc, come in. I think I need to talk to a parent. Mm. So, what's he like? I'm not sure Sullen. Tell Bad. He puts up so many barriers. Keep in mind, he's had 20 years to be angry that his father wasn't there. It's going to take some time to get over those feelings. But I do think it's possible. Perhaps it would be best if I left him alone. Let him come to me if he wants to. Are you doing the best thing for Jason? Or what's easiest for you? Can you hear me? I will kill him, Picard. Sensors don't show any sign of an intruder. Could it have been another hologram? I don't think so, Captain. I'll recalibrate the sensors to scan for low-intensity transmissions. Just to be sure, I'll sweep your quarters with a resident scanner. Good. Keep me posted. I have compiled all available records pertaining to Jason Vigo's criminal record. <laughs> yes, sir. You <laughs> nailed him so immediately. You were like, yeah, he wants to steal things. Conduct. This is the information you requested, is it not? What? It is. I mean, yes and no. Requested information. Didn't realize these were going to be the details. Yeah. Okay, security detail. You can be a little less weird about it. <laughs> yeah, geez. We're supposed to be keeping an eye on you. Can't you keep an eye on me from over there? Mm -hmm. Give me some space. Get out of my bubble. Bok appeared in my quarters last well. night. No, it might not have been him. I appreciate what you're trying to do. <sighs> it's very Captain, hard. As soon as this thing with Bok is over, I'm leaving. Let me know as soon as you catch him, all right? Ouch. 
Captain, the probe systems are overloading. Red alert, uh -oh. shields up. Yep. Just another Captain moment report. going to a red alert. I bet everyone on the ship just ignores red alert. Captain, like in school, and when they're in class, they're like, yeah, just ignore the red alert. Yeah, yeah, we gotta keep going on. He's proved that he can get to us whenever he wants. How is he doing all this? Oh, apparently in the Genesis episode, his fish yeah. turned to jellyfish. <laughs> if you want to stay off, you I didn't catch it. I didn't either. <laughs> I'm sorry, but there's nothing I can do to bring him back. How touching. Pay me with your son's life. Mm -hmm. No, you don't have any choice. Roads to sick bay. Medical emergency. Deck nine, section four. Uh, Let's go. Uh... Oh, fuck. <laughs> Like yeah. he, something was already happening. He was having like a tremor. Any like yeah. tremor, yeah. Do you have any idea what's wrong with me? You have a condition called the Forrester Trent syndrome. It's a degenerative neurological disorder. Very rare. I'm going to start you on a neurostabilization regimen. If we're lucky, it will halt the degeneration and maybe reverse its effects. Hmm. There have been some cases reported where the disease was instigated by a random mutation. I'll run a microcellular scan and see if that's what happened. Huh. Bach was in direct contact with this chair for an extended period. It is showing a distinctive subspace signature as a result. We think he's using some kind of subspace transporter. In theory, it could operate over several light years. Yeah. Woo! That means that the probe that exploded could have been beamed into position from some point outside sensor range. I want to try rock climbing. It's so much fun. I want to get back into it. Without climbing shoes or gloves. Mm -hmm. I think I could climb that. Yeah, right? There's some good hooks. Like, there's some good crevices. Yeah. And... Not bad. Gosh, it's so interesting. And then they, if they were to say computer end program, they would just be would on they the just floor. fall? Yeah. <laughs> this could all soon be over. You came all the way up here just to tell me that. <laughs> I thought it would make you feel better. <laughs> Thanks. It was nice of you. Oh. She was attacked by two men in, in the street in broad daylight for the food she was carrying. My mother made sure that we were all tough enough to make it. Oh. Jason, is not there some way that I can be a father to you? I'm not anybody you'd want for a son. Oh. Trust me. You're so wrong. Oh, really? Let me spell it out for you. I lie. I steal. I use people. I know all about your troubles with the Cayman authorities. You do? It doesn't make any difference, Jason. You're still my son. But one thing is clear. You'll never look at your hairline again in the same way. <laughs> <laughs> something you need to know. He's not his son. Sir, sensors are detecting a subspace carrier wave happened. headed for the ship. Bach is trying to use his transporter. Bach is beaming Jason off the ship. He's in pieces. Adams, Adams, he's in pieces. Oh my God. Oh my Bach God. Is establishing his lock on it. Fifteen years ago, you took my son away from me. Today, I will take your son away from you. <laughs> it will be our anniversary. Ew. The modifications you made to the transporter. Is there any way we could use a subspace transport from here to get me on the box ship? Oof. It may be possible, sir, but it would not be advisable. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Yes. <laughs> yes. Captain, we might be able to get you over there, but I don't see how we're going to get you back. We'll deal with that when the time comes. I don't give a fuck. You guys not hear me. I Trans don't care. Yeah, we are going to deal with this. The subspace field coils. Lower your weapons. Our Bok is dead. You know as well as I do, Bok. It's not, He's my, not son. my son. You changed it. Uh, I know what you've done. No, he'll never pay the ransom. Shut up. There never was a ransom. All he was ever interested in was vengeance. If you let the two of us go, they won't attack you. Haha! -ha, convinced! Yeah, Ferengi are out for themselves. What? I uh, put a little something into your bag while you were packing. Yep. I know you would probably have preferred a bottle of sari and brandy, but uh, <laughs> that's all I could come up with. Such a cruel, 
cruel yeah. thing to do to somebody. Truly. Yeah, to be like, I'm gonna change this person's DNA so it appears like he's your son so I can kill him so that you feel bad. So, so, Pretty so cruel. Up. It is so cruel. Yeah. And this I mean, guy he's like, a bad guy that's not a good person, you know, so like, obviously. Just being but. like, oh, I thought maybe I figured out who my dad was, whether whatever complicated feelings that invokes in me, that's, you know, something. And then to learn that actually, no, it wasn't. And all those complicated feelings were for nothing. It's or like for nothing. Oh, and okay. then you had like a little taste of like, what would it be like to have yeah. this person as my this father? person who might, yeah, like love you unconditionally. And yeah. Gosh, it's just so cruel. It's pretty, um... Yeah, the moment she yeah. talked about, uh... She was like, oh, this could happen if something's changed. I was like, mm -hmm. oh... Mm -hmm. This is gonna- this is gonna be a plot point that reveals something, oh, yeah. Oh, uh-oh. Mm -hmm. Um... Oops, did I just... Nah, we're good. Um... <laughs> yeah, that was, uh... It was a good episode. Um, yeah. So interesting, this like back to back to back of family, family, family. Yeah. Um, not bad, uh, just very like, wow. It really has been, yeah, like these are, yeah. Just one hit after another, you know? And yeah, they don't even, which we always say this about Gates McFadden, we, and I will forever. Um, she is just is such a beautiful actor and the way that she can portray so much emotion yeah without a single fucking yes. word or yes. even if she has four words with the subtext underneath mm -hmm. it when she broke the news of him being of like picard being his yeah. father the way she delivered that line was just like there's yeah. so much emotion behind that. We didn't yeah. even get to tackle that side yeah. of it. But you know she felt something. Yeah. Because she loves him. Yeah. How could she not? Uh, oh. So the apparently the idea for this episode came up because when they were filming Masks, well, you know, where uh, Brent mm -hmm. Spiner got to play all these different kind of like kinds of emotional states and whatever. Uh, I guess they asked Patrick Stewart, like, are there any aspects of your character that you feel like are unexplored? Mm -hmm. And he said, you know, this character from the first season, like, he's just this, I'm always fascinated by this idea that there's this person out there who wants revenge on my character. And we've just never seen him never again. Wouldn't that be interesting it. if we revisited that? So I guess that's part of the reason mm -hmm. they decided to, like, okay. tackle this thing, even though... Like who could really remember other than Patrick yeah. Stewart? Um. <laughs> and if that's the if that is the case, and that is very cool as an actor to be asked something like that. Yeah, like hey, what what have hey, we not done with your character yet? Now that we're yeah. coming up on the end of this show, yeah. What full circle did you want from your character arc yeah. that you didn't receive? Um, that's very cool. I like that yeah. a lot. Um, it is just a very interesting, you know, you remember this guy? I'm like, fuck no, I don't know. And I'm like, who? What? I trust you remember me, Picard. I'm like, he's the only one. That's it. The rest Picard's... of us sure don't. Ooh, excuse me. No. The rest of us sure don't remember. Hey, did you remember, Bach, when you first watched this episode? I'd be so I'd love to, to know. know. Please let us know in the comments below if you remembered Bach or if you were also like, who? Huh? What? <laughs> what? Um, you so know, six what? years later. So let us it's, know about that. Well, it's so long. It's so for us. It's been five years. Or, or yes, so, like four years. But if you were watching, watching this TNG, show as it aired, six years. Yeah, I can't remember. No, but, <laughs> um. Yeah. Goodness, I'm so curious how the rest of this season is gonna go. Oh, uh, you like, guys. What's it gonna be like? What are they gonna conquer in these last few? Oh, I'm so, I'm gonna, so, yeah. I'm so interested. I'm so interested. I'm so interested. I don't know, y'all. Let's see here. Do this you is want the last to time know? You get to do this. Do you want to know the names of the uh, last four episodes? Maybe. I don't know. I don't think I'm ready. Okay. 
This is the last, like, one of the last times you get to look ahead, though, and be like, ooh, this is what we have. I know, right? Yeah. Mm. It's... What a wild, wild It's so life. strange to look at this list of episodes right now and see four left. That's crazy. Yeah. That's crazy. What a journey this has been, y'all. Holy I'm shit. so glad we've done this, though. It's like, so good. What a special so treat to get to, to yeah. share Doctor Who and Star Trek The Next Generation with one each other. Like, yeah. it feels like such a... Ugh. Such a cool thing, because both on I like I not uh, on either end of the spectrum, both were a TV show that we were both just so intimidated by, because yeah. there was just too much of it. And we yeah. were like, I don't know. like how do I start this? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't want to fuck with it. Like I don't want to. Uh, yeah. You know, because for me, I got to the point where I was too. I was like, I don't even want to jump into the movies. I was like, I'm not even gonna. Yeah. No, not even gonna try. Everyone was like, but these new ones don't even have to do with that. And I was like, yeah, I don't wanna. I know nothing about Star. I just yeah. don't wanna. <laughs> Now I'm just like, oh, now I'm kind of interested in J.J. Abrams, like, Star Trek movies. Like, I know mm -hmm. that they're a very different vibe, but, like, mm -hmm. I still want to watch them now. Yeah. Yeah. You could. You could watch them. Uh, well, y'all. Yeah, Ugh. one more episode to this, and then uh, on to the next thing. And then we have boldly watched what I had never seen before. And now you have. An end of an era coming up. Journey's end. Um, if you want to support this era we've been yes. in and what the era future might hold, the future yes. era might hold. I know we talked about it in the beginning, but. Yes, just quick reminder, support us on Patreon, patreon.com slash Gals. Thank you to everyone oh. who does that. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Leave us a comment. Let us know. Like I said, do you remember Bach? Let us know. Uh, Give the video a like and talk yes. about it with someone who you think might enjoy watching these reactions. Let them know they exist because uh, that helps grow what we're doing, which is uh, great. That that helps support us as well. So thank you. Very much so, y'all. So thanks. Catch Gala for Gals next time, I guess. We boldly watch what no cat has never seen before. For a little bit longer. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, go ahead and give it a little thumbs up. And if you want to be notified when we post new content, go ahead and subscribe to our channel and hit that little bell in the corner.